Born on this day, 1917, country singer-songwriter Merle Travis, who invented the first solid-body electric guitar. In 1952, this song hits number one. It's Joni James and Why Don't You Believe Me. 1959, the Grammy Awards were first televised on NBC. 1963, the number one hit is The Beatles' I Want to Hold Your Hand, knocking out the other Beatles hit, She Loves You, from the number one slot, giving them both the number one and number two in the UK charts. In 1964, Canadian actor Lauren Green plays Pa Cartwright on the NBC TV show Bonanza, has a number one Billboard pop hit with this single, Ringo, the second Canadian to have a number one in the US. In 1969, the Beatles went to number one on the US singles chart with their 26th release, Come Together. It also became the group's 18th U.S. number one. Same year, 1969, number two on the charts is Blood, Sweat and Tears and When I Die. The group is led by Toronto rocker David Clayton Thomas. In 1975, number one hit is Silver Convention with this song, Fly, Robin, Fly. In 1978, Neil Young's 13th solo album, Comes a Time, Goes Gold. In 1994, My Life, the second studio album by Mary J. Blige is released. In 2010, this song is released by Adele. It's called Rolling in the Deep. 2014, number one hit goes to Taylor Swift and Blank Space.